Hello and welcome back to Buried in Oblivion. My name is Hair Monster. I am your humble host, and today, at some point, Keen dives into the strange world of mutations. Deep under the lake, where no human eye has ever seen anything before, lies a creature so foul, so primitive, so disgusting, that it shall not be mentioned here. I'm just kidding. Dope fish is here, everybody. Hell yeah. Welcome back. Good to see you. I'll stop doing my weird British impression and, uh, you know, talk normal. <laughs> yes, in just a few minutes, uh, in just a few minutes, we're gonna see our old friend again. But first, hi Sprite, you can see all this crazy stuff off to the left. How do we get in there? Oh, I might know the way. But we won't find that out until far in the future. For now, let us go meet the one and only, the legend himself, the Dope Fish. <laughs> Hi, Dope Fish. Okay, let's, uh, let's just get going on this. Uh, this level's kind of like the Well of Wishes in, uh, you know, around the other side of the planet on Gnosticus 4. Oh. In that, uh, there's a lot of dead ends and there's a lot of just little candy items, so I'm not going to really worry about gathering everything. Not in this part, anyways. For now, I just gotta worry about getting by this incredibly hungry and stupid fish. Let's see what we can do. Go, go, go! Yes, I made it! Can't get me! <laughs> Chomp. Yeah, check out all the extra lives in there. There's some, there's some goodies to be had. Alright. Take a bite. Come on. Oh. That's not what I meant. You know what I'm trying to do, dope fish. Okay. I need to get going to the right of the level, so let's see if I can't just outrun this thing. World's second dumbest creature. Look at that, blown up and eaten. What a way to die. Alright. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, ooh, there we go. Go, run, run, swim, swim as fast as you can, Keen. Go, oh, man, go. Oh, we made it past the first two. Awesome. Awesome sauce. So, going over this way is a dead end with not that much candy in it. So, uh, I think we shall proceed forward. And there's a couple more here that I have to get by. <laughs> Look at that crazy fish. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This seems like a good spot for another save. Yes, I do fully intend on Im abusing the saves today. So, you know, this is a good spot right here to get by. He'll try to he'll try to take a bite, but he'll miss you. So then you can escape, you know. I don't think there's anything down here. Oh, there's a couple of jawbreakers. While we're here, might as well grab them. Go, go, go! All 
right now. Uh -oh. So my eventual destination in here is a tube that's going to lead up into the disappearing city. For now it seems that we have simply dove into the lake. <laughs> For some reason this one's always doing that. Just totally spazzing out. Not sure what's up with this dope fish. He's having trouble. Oh! Okay. So this is not the tube that I've come here for. But it's a tube that I want to show off because it says... Nisaba. My tube is to the left of this place. Oh, and this is not a blind run, by the way. I've I've been somewhat practicing this level. I did record my blind playthrough, but it took me 47 minutes, and I think that's just way longer of a video than I want. So, I um, did a little rehearsing, and decided to... Oh, man. Okay. Try again. Boy, I went back a ways, too. That's all right. Come on, dope fish. Let me up there. Chomp. See ya. You gassy bastard. Let's just run straight for our tube. Because I want to get up into the city. Actually, it's not a city. It's a... It's a kind of like a museum. Well, we'll see when we get there. There we go. Got by the mines. Escape the wrath of that sprite. And I should have this. And here we go. Here's our tube. Up we go. Keen gets lifted up to the Gallery of Fame. Welcome to the museum. Here's a fine display of a wetsuit. Anastasine. A treasure eater. A bluebird egg. The foot. The sky pest. And that is the end of the line. This is my stop. This is where I'll be getting off. Let us begin. The Gallery of Fame. <laughs> okay, Wormuth. Gotcha. This level's uh, kind of dangerous on hard mode, I gotta tell you. There's a lot of Wormuths here, and there's a lot of my best friend ever, the Sky Pest. But I really like the idea. I like how there are displays of sort of different things from Keen 4, and I like the idea that this is. This whole place is floating above the lake. And uh, we'll see that as we go along, of course. Let's see, now I gotta get back up to that green gem up there. Oh man, dang it. I guess we'll just wait. There we go. Ugh. Bugs. Stop 
stupid, stupid bugs. Okay, let's go open the green door. Bingo! Zap. This seems like a fine spot for a save, I'd say. Well, not just yet. One more thing to do. Hopefully I don't die doing it and look like a fool. There we go. just want to pop over and grab that stuff, because it's not too difficult. There we are. Now let's save. Saving dope fish. Oh yeah. Since I did just save, I might as well point this out. Um, you can see how this is a this whole place is floating above the lake. You can see the lake down there, but uh, if you manage to fall in fall into the lake there, you're uh, dead. So I would recommend avoiding that if you can. Because Keen doesn't have his wetsuit on, and he, you know that he can't swim. Poor guy. Never learned to swim. This sign says, Candy Junk, because this level was made by Mark the Candy Junk and Nisaba. Squish. Come here. All right, got those guys. Pop up and get the donuts. What's nice about this uh, level is if you do fall into the lake, in a lot of places there are one-ups where you can, where it is possible to accidentally fall in. So you're not, you know, if you're low on lives, you'll at least get a one-up to, uh, you know, help you along so it doesn't just take all your lives away. Hey, oh, hey, it's my Die! Thank you. <laughs> Let's get the other one, too. Holy crap. I'm really starting to remember why I was having such bad disagreements with these little creatures back in, you know, back on the Shadowlands. Starting to remember just how much I hate the Sky Pest. <laughs> hey, look at that. An extra life. Speaking of extra lives, I do believe today I'll be hitting 640,000 points. Okay. This little ramp is kind of dangerous. There's a slug. And two wormets. There we go. Alright, survived that. Now, time for a save. Because we have something interesting to show off. An ice cream! And a wormoth. Now, watch watch this wormoth. <laughs> it's a magic wormoth. He can bite through solid glass in a single bound. Uh, let's see now. Don't have any gems. Uh. Perfect, that will work. Oh, now with the blue gem. Time to head back. Where was that? Oh, that was up here. Yes, that's right. This level's kind of got a confusing layout, which is kind of why it took me so long to do the blind playthrough. Oh, and Keen will totally spaz out if you stand right here. <laughs> Sorry, Keen. That's probably not good for him. Uh, 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 uh. Zap. 
Um, oh, let's see. Let's grab the chocolate. I kind of want to try to go get that ice cream now that this worm is taken out. So I haven't really tried it yet. So let's save and give it a couple of shots and see what happens. See if I can't grab that. Oh yeah, I made it. First try, nice. Yeah, I haven't I have not attempted that yet. Because it looked like it was really hard, but I guess uh it's not that bad. Let's see, now where in the heck am I going? Oh, I know where. This thing. That switch that I just pressed got this going. Bug. Oh, I hit it. Alright, poison slug. Ooh, you come here and you... Oh my god, this is... I don't... No, no. Escape, run! I really panicked just now. Come on, land. No, as soon as you land. Oh my god, really? Wow. That was a conspiracy. Okay. Oops. Yeah, now I'm going to have trouble getting that. I'm thinking that I might just leave that right where it is and say goodbye, ice cream. Let's go back up this way. See if I can't get my revenge on those two sky pests that ganged up on me. I really like the dope fish in the aquarium. That's cool. I've got a fish tank. I should find a green fish and name it dope fish, you know? <laughs> I don't know why I never thought of that until now. Okay, enough joking around, you little shits. I'm, t I'm getting up there, and there's nothing you can do about it, so... Little bastard, winged, demonite, deadite bastards. Die! Oh, really? Alone. You know, Skypest, let's have a little talk here. This is my YouTube channel, not yours. These are my videos, not yours. This is my show, so quit hogging the spotlight. <laughs> we'll see how he behaves now that I've given it a stern talking to. You hear me? You gotta behave yourself. Good! See that? You just gotta tell them how it is. And they will listen and obey. I can't believe that worked. I just started yelling at it, and it, it behaved itself. Okay. Hi, Dopefish. It's funny you can get him to eat the little school fish. Take a bite. 
Alright. We shall grab the donut and let's head up uh, this way. Because here is the red gem. Now, aren't we thankful that they're in there, not out here? Man. How many do you think that is? Like eight or nine of them? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just glad they're trapped. Ooh! 640,000 points for an extra life. Next extra at 1,280,000. 31 lives, 15 ammo. Nice. Five Gnosticians rescued. Should have three more, right? Seems like a nice spot for a save, I think. Okay, well, I just zapped everybody. <laughs> Poor little school fish. Go on, come and get that one. Come on, you got one more. Take a bite, eat it. No, you must not be hungry anymore. I thought you dope fish were always hungry. <laughs> I just love it. A dope fish in a tank. Alrighty. A few more drops around here, yes. I saw you up there, so, uh... Squish. There we go, get the donuts, crack open the gem. Now that platform is operated by the switch there. And up we go. Zap. Hey, how are we doing? Up to 16! Yay! And we are getting... Getting close to the exit at this point. I like this fish tank, too. I'm a, I'm a pretty big fan of aquariums in real life. That is a fall to my doom, so let's not go down there. That sign says, watch out. Alright, thank you, Mad Mushroom. Always a pleasure. Here, instead of a aquarium, we have a terrarium. Hi, slug. I think that's what it's called, right? When you have a little glass tank with a tarantula in it. It's a terrarium, I think. Don't quote me on that. I could be wrong. Anyways, here is our Gnosticine. Now, this, this guy we will talk to to leave the level. But there's... When we started this place, there was another Gnosticine off to the left. Now, I don't know if you can get in and talk to that guy. Or if it... If he even... Ugh, has anything to say. And I guess for now, that question is going to... Remain unanswered. Guess who's up there? I'll give you one guess. 
You guessed correctly. A sky vest. <laughs> Alright, let's go up and deal with the little shit. Gotcha! There we go. This, you can bonk your head on because it's the very, very top of the level up here. Now the pole leads down to the Gnosticene, but there's more stuff off to the right. And that stuff took me a little while to find. But the way to get it is just up here. There we go. Okay, so you know me. Falling and getting a lot of candy is one of my favorite things ever. So let's just enjoy this, shall we? Awesome. I missed a few sticks of gum, but still awesome. And there we go. There's another platform right there to get back out. Now let's go talk to the Nostocene. Now, unfortunately, since I already did the blind playthrough, I know what this guy has to say, but it's still pretty funny. You know, being a mortal is as boring as a pictureization of an encyclopedia. So we launched some customized tours and adventure trips. Having fun? My innocence has been shattered by this blatant tourist trap. I want my money back. You didn't pay anything. Good point. <laughs> I like that. I think that's the funniest one so far, in my opinion. Okay, well, anyways. The, uh... Gallery of Fame has been completed. I really like the idea. It's, it's cool. How you start by going underwater and then come up into the disappearing city, which is floating above the lake. It's just, it's cool, I like that. And as you can see, the well now flies the K of Galactic Justice, but that level is still available. I can still go and play the well. And I might just do that next time, I'm not really sure. But uh, until I figure out what happens next time, you know what's coming. <laughs> I'm Hair Monster, and I'll catch you on the flip side. See you guys. See where the sky pest is? <laughs> Not sure how it's doing that. Oh my god. 